Hello, Tatiana. Hello, how are you today? I'm great. And how about you? How are you? Fine, thanks. Did you have a good day today? Yes, I have a great day. Oh, and you? What did you? Great. Also, what did you do? Um, first one, I go to my job. And I went? Then I went to my job. I mm -hmm. went to my job. And then I had a meet with my with my boss. A meeting? A meeting with my boss. Mm -hmm. And after that, I uh, ate with my friend. And where did you go to eat? Pizza Hut. Excellent. Did you have pizza or lasagna or? Lasagna. Uh, lasagna. I love lasagna. <laughs> And lasagna, the normal, the traditional, or lasagna with loroco, or what? Traditional. Okay. Okay. And what did you drink, Tatiana? I drink Coke. Drink. Drank Coke because I like. <laughs> Coke? Yes. Mm. But in Pizza Hut, they don't have Coke. No Coca-Cola, or yes? Yes. Really? Yes. Um, I thought Pizza Hut only had Pepsi. No. No. Okay. Maybe I'm confused. But it sounds like you had a great day with your friends. Yes. And is this normal, Tatiana? Mm, yes. Sometimes. Once a week, once a month. Once a week. Once a week. <laughs> Excellent. And what about you, Noe? How was your day? No, you have to lower the microphone. It's too far. The microphone, move, move closer to the mouth. Put down. There, yes? A little bit more. Try move down a little bit more. No. More or less. Okay. 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 How was your day, Noah? Um, I'm this day, uh, very nice. Uh huh. Why? What happened? Uh, because I, uh, in my, in my work, I, I go, uh, traveling, uh, in this afternoon, uh, because uh, celebrate uh, in meeting my co worker, uh -huh. you celebrated, celebrate, yes, celebrate, celebrate, uh, celebrate with my co worker, no. celebrated, celebrated. Celebrate, ah, yes, 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 yes. excuse me, celebrate it uh, mm -hmm. with my co worker in the afternoon. In, I have a meeting for, how do you say, share, share, and uh, uh, in this meeting with my Joe um, co worker. Oh, okay, okay. Uh, Yes. But it's it was a, a good day, a productive day. Yes, good day because I I I como digo, la pasamos. I spent last then spent. Mm -hmm. Okay, last then very nice in the afternoon. Okay, great. Well, it's great to have everybody here. And good that you are talking about your day and the activities. Today, we're gonna to continue with our objectives, which are understand imperatives and infinitives. Here, we're going to have a Juan Linares is going to read for us a little bit the objective for today's class. Okay, at the end of this 
session, you will understand how to use in imperative and infinitive for given suggestion. Good, suggestion. pronunciation, suggestions. Okay, suggestions. Okay, good. Hello everyone. Before you watch the video, I want to remind you that imperatives are commands and they don't need a subject. Also, for giving suggestions, we will use an imperative as well as an infinitive. Stay around for more explanation. Imperatives and infinitives for giving suggestions. Be sure to turn it on. Don't forget to dial the area code. Make sure to hit the end button. Remember to pay the bill every month. Try not to talk for too long. This is how we'll use imperatives and infinitives for giving suggestions. When using an imperative, the subject is never mentioned and they always begin with a verb. And as said on the previous explanation, the infinitive is to plus a verb. Now let's think about a situation. These two kids are new to their English class and they say, we don't understand English. So let's give them a suggestion. We can say, study your verbs. But this sounds more like an instruction. So to make it a bit more polite and to actually sound like a suggestion, we may add, make sure to study your verbs. Check at the beginning we have no subject and then a verb, which means it's an imperative. Make sure. Moving forward to our infinitive to study. So when we put an imperative with an infinitive together, we can come up with a great suggestion. We will leave you now with some common expressions we use as imperatives to give suggestions. Okay. Suggestions is another way to say recommendations. And there are different ways to make it. There is a nice way or the polite way, like with your job, with your coworkers. And then there is the way that your mom tells you, right? So when you think about your mom and your, your dad, they say, hey, clean the room, wash the dishes. Ah, take out the garbage. Maybe your wife, put your shoes in the place or your husband, cook dinner. Ah, uh, these are imperatives, but it's not a good suggestion. It feels very violent. It feels very strong. So the nice way to make it sound pretty and comfortable is we use expressions. Those are the expressions, for example, make sure. Also is the expressions that we see here. Make sure, be sure don't forget, remember and try. These are to make the same instructions, but nice. Be sure, make sure, don't forget, remember, try. Let's make examples using these expressions. Be sure to practice with your friends. Make sure to use a dictionary. Don't forget to think in English. Remember to do your English homework. Try to pronounce properly. Now read these suggestions. Be sure to speak in your native language. Make sure to forget your dictionary. Don't forget to stay quiet in class. Remember to translate into your native language. Try to mispronounce the words. You will agree with me that they are not good suggestions to give an English student. Therefore, we need to add the word not to make them positive suggestions. So the word not will go between the imperative and the infinitive. Now it is your turn. Ready to come up with examples of your own? Try it and write them on our discussion box. Okay, so here we see, we can say, be sure to speak or be sure not to speak. So if I say, ah, I want to improve my English, the correct is going to be in the negative. Uh, be sure not to speak in your native language or you can make it in the positive. Be sure to speak English in your classes. So we can use negative or positive ways to give the effect that we want, our opinions and recommendations. Is that okay? Any questions? No? Not teacher. Okay. Maria has a small question. Go ahead, Maria. Teacher, uh, I don't listen. 
The audio. Ah, and the others? Listen the audios or no? Uh -huh. Yes, I listen. Yes. yes, I listen. I listen. Okay. Maria, check the, check the computer then. But I put the audio again, relax. I put the audio again, but check no, the computer. No, no. No. No use micro. Hey, como se llama? Audio. El... <laughs> no uso audífonos. No. 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 But I don't se know. Se escucha, pero suavecito, bien, así, bien. Y tiene todo el volumen. Ajá. Uh -huh. Yes. Okay. And my voice, how is my voice, Maria? Sí, pero bien suavecito. La, la mía. Ajá, uh -huh, la suya. Okay. Los demás, ¿cómo escuchan mi voz? Oh, Alice. Very clear. Very good. It's clear. It's clear. It's clear. Sí. Entonces, sí, Maria. Clear. Entonces, sí, es, es algo de tu máquina, María. Computer. Okay. Uh -huh. computer. Eh, María, lo, lo, puede, lo que puedes hacer, hay dos opciones. Uno, reiniciar la máquina para ver si algo y meterte de nuevo. O solo intentar saliendo de la clase y metiéndote de nuevo para ver si ese es el problema. del Y a veces solo con eso ya se puede. Okay, thank you. You're welcome. Sorry, María. Ahí sí. Si es del lado mío, con mucho gusto. Okay. No so, worries. all right. Now, what are we going to do? Now we are going to create a drama. We are going to create recommendations, give opinions and suggestions. For example, I'm going to ask my partner, hey, Noe, how can I improve my English? And Noe is going to use the expressions, the expressions from today's class. Be sure to make sure to don't remember? forget to remember. Okay, as an example, Noe, how can I improve my English? Oh, make sure to study your and do your homework every day. Also, remember to speak in English when possible and try to uh, work. This is the idea. This is the drama. How can I improve my English? One, oh, I want to look, I want to look like Captain America. I want to look like, ah, The Rock. What can I do? Ah, my partner give me suggestions. Jaime, I want to make delicious food. What, ah, or no, I want to have, uh, I want to have a party catered. What can, I, ah, whatever situation. You and your partner invent any situation, but is obligation, use the vocabulary. Suggestions, recommendations, opinions. Be sure to, make sure to, remember not to. Uh, try not to, positive and negative, okay? Okay. 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 All right. Okay. And the drama, your drama, you and your partner have to speak for one minute. I don't know. No sé qué van a decir, pero one minute, you have to speak. One minute. Ya los, los dos días anteriores, muy cortito, me lo están dejando. So today, one minute, you need to prepare. Yes? Yes. Okay.
Okay. Jose. Do you have problems with internet too, right? Rodolfo, you okay? You have some problems? I oh, know you came late. I see. Okay, I put you in the group.
Okay. Let's see the dramas. Let's see how to use the vocabulary correctly. Who is the first group? Uh, me, Tatiana, and Maria. Okay, let's do it. Um, I um, I'm going to the beach the next weekend. Don't forget your sunscreen. Oh, yeah. Thanks. And don't forget pick me in my house, please. Oh, oh. oh great. Thank you. Thank you. Remember, you need to buy some food and drinks. Um, drinks, a lot of water. A lot of water, please. Oh, yeah. You're right. Thanks for. Okay, all right. Great job using the vocabulary. Excellent making the suggestions. I mean, we practice more on the fluency to make the sentence more natural. But good job, very nice. Excellent. Next group. Okay. Let's go, let's go. Ana Maria, Jaime, Juan Linares. Okay. Hey. Hello, hello, partner. Hello, Ana Maria. Hello. Hello, hello Juan Linares. How are you? Uh, fine. Okay. Uh, be sure to practice English every day. Thank you, thank you, Ana Maria. Yes, and, and John Linares, don't forget practice English with your with your family and your, your partners. Yes, thank you. Thank you. Uh, I always uh, practice English with some friends, um, and you uh, remember that. Remember, I'm sorry. Can you remember? Don't forget practice English with some friends or your mother or father or sister. But it is important. Important uh, always practice. Okay, thank you. I practice every day with my daughter. Okay. Okay, good suggestions, good ideas. Remember, that's the idea. Be sure to, and using the vocabulary, don't forget. Good, all right. And the last presentation. Rodolfo, Jaime, no? Okay. Jaime, me escucha? Yes, yes, yes. Okay, I can see, I can hear it. Okay, okay. Eh, veamos la que habíamos eh, elaborado. Fue contigo, ¿verdad? Oh. Ah, what happened? What happened with the Spanish? Eh? This is all, oh, this is Spanish. What? <laughs> English. Uh-huh. English. Yeah, okay. Yes, this is where we, 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 were talking, we were talking about the instruction and some steps of use or how to use a blender. Okay, I I um, ask you ask you uh, the, the, a question. Um, uh, Jaime, you can help me how you use a blender, please. Okay. Um, yeah. Um, I 
will I will tell you five steps for how to use a blender. First, uh, um, assemble the blender, placing the glass on the on the bus. Then we must connect the cable to a power supply network. Uh, next, we must now place the fridge in the bowl. And after now, we'll, we will place water and sugar to test. And finally, mix by pressing the button and, and serve. Hey, thank you, Jaime. You know, uh, most to use uh, the uh, blender in your home. I, I can see you now prepare and use in, in, in your homework, in your home, sorry. Okay. Okay, teacher. Okay. Thank you, no. Thank you, Jaime. Thank you for making it. Uh, remember, uh, you needed to use the vocabulary. The vocabulary is making suggestions. Suggestions, no giving instructions is different. In instructions is the process. Suggestions are the opinions or the recommendations. Okay. okay. So, uh -huh. so remember, it, Practice this vocabulary, okay? Now, good job. We have the idea. Remember, the infinitive is always begin with the verb, but to and the verb. The imperative begin the instructions. The idea to be nice. So not only ah, clean, uh, wash the dishes, clean the clothes, cook dinner. No, imagine your husband, your wife say, hey, hace la cena. It sounds very strange, right? Very strong. But if you say, ah, remember to, or, uh, or you use the expression, make sure, uh, try to, uh, this is different. That's why we use it. The same thing in English, the same in Spanish. You don't want to be violent. You want to be nice. Okay? Teacher. All right. Excellent. Now we're going to check the homework. Remember, today you had to prepare the process, the steps, how to do something. Do you remember? Yes. Excellent. You're going to have one opportunity to practice with your partner and to see if you remember the homework. Then after with your partner, then we're going to come back and we're going to create, okay? We're, we're sorry, we're going to speak. So you have one opportunity to practice with the partner and then you present to the class. Okay. Okay.
Okay, guys, are you ready? Yes. Excellent. Yeah, we are ready. All right, who's going to present first? Who's number one? Me, teacher. Excellent, Tatiana, go ahead. Uh, I talk about how to use a washing machine. Okay. Uh, first one, you need to separate your clothes, uh, color black, color white, or other colors. Then you have to put your clothes into the wash machine. After that, uh, you add to detergent and softener. And I think finally you close the wash machine and turn on. Okay, all right, very nice. In English, we don't use the word color. So you don't say you separate your clothes color black, color white. Only you separate your clothes into blacks and whites. Okay. So never, oh, I like the shirt color, color blue, for example. No, I like the blue shirt, only the word. Okay, teacher. Excellent, Thank Tatiana, you. good job. Okay, the next. Me, teacher. Oh, ah, look, I won, all right, one. Okay. How to use the microwave? First, you must make sure that it's connected. And after, press the button, the, press the button to open the door where we will put the food. And finally, we close the microwave door and program the minute to hit the food. Only that. Okay, all right, one. I see, I see. Good job, excellent, you have it. Remember to make connectors. You use the word first, that's good. But also you need to use more connectors. Then, after that, next. That way you are talking the process, okay? Okay. All right, good job, one. All right, who's next? Me. Okay. Uh, how to use the club map? Jose? Uh, Try uh, again. Um, how to use the club matter. Okay. And how, how to perform the measure of electrical tension. First, we turn on the device. Jose, don't read. Second, it's not reading exercise. It's speaking. It's speaking. Uh, no second, reading. Um, yeah. Second, um, choose the item according to the measure of to release. Um, third, we place the clamp around the cable. And, and how like this? Um, and release. Uh, then check the check the screen of the device and press hold key to save the medition data. Um, after that, we have to key the clock matter. Finally, warning: Do you not use the device? You. Do you have in the basic knowledge of electricity? Okay, all right, Jose. Thank you very much for preparing. I, I know because you have a lot of technical. Remember, the idea is to improve speaking, not read. So good that you have the information and try to explain in your own words. It's not necessary to use the technical words. If you can explain in your own. It's the idea to get more fluency, okay? Good job, Jose, all right. Who's next, who's next? Me, teacher. All right, Maria. Okay, I talk about how to use microwave. Uh, first, uh, turn on. Uh, next, put, uh, put in a foot. After that, uh, 
put a time, one, two or three minutes, or the time, the food needed. Uh, finally, it's ready, the food for to eat. Only that is. Okay, very good, Maria, very good. Okay, only two small mistakes. Okay, first, that the is only one word, four or two, not not together, not for to eat, only to eat or for eating, one of the two. Okay, and then the pronunciation. Finally, fine, excellent. Fine. Mm -hmm. Good job, Maria. Very nice process. Okay. Who's the next one? Who's the next person? Me, teacher. Excellent, Rodolfo. Good. Uh, I talk about how do you use uh, electric oven? First, connect the electric oven. After that, push the turkey option. Uh, the the bottom in place a turkey next you should have for 30 minutes and then you can to eat a delicious dish for the family it's a, a simple dish mm -hmm. i don't know because the turkey very difficult but you explain very simple <laughs> <laughs> ah, okay, okay. Good job, Rodolfo. Remember, only one way with models is not correct to. Is not correct with, for example, you can to eat. No, it's only you can eat. You can eat, okay, teacher. Correct. All the models. No, the models not to. No, you should to eat or you, you may to eat. No, always is the model, the verb. Good job, Rodolfo. Okay. All right. The next, the next. Me teacher. Okay, no. Me teacher. Uh, how to print from the device? You can print from Chrome on your Android device uh, to print from your phone. As the printed that can receive that our Wi-Fi or mobile network. Uh, Consider the next uh, stick pairs um, on your on your other Android device. Open the Chrome um, app and then open the page or image or file you want to print. Um, after um, in the in the top right corner, that's more share. And um, next, select print. And finally, uh, press printer. Okay, very good job. Very good job, Noe. Only way you're going to improve the pronunciation. Your R is too strong. We have to make the R softer. So for example, pronounce press. Press. Correct. Uh -huh. Press. The R okay. soft, soft R. Very good. And then you say the app. 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 No A P. Not uh -huh. okay. the, the pronunciation app. Okay. Excellent. Thank, R. Thank I, I you. Not teacher. I say not teacher. Thank you. Thank you. Good job. Okay. So we have we need Jaime, Anna, or well, yes, Jaime, Jaime, or Anna. Who's next? Who's next? Teacher. Hello, teacher. Um, good evening. Uh, this is my first class, and I no understand very well. Do you speak in this night? Ah. Okay, Anna. Uh -huh. Thank you. Uh, I need your your um, help. Uh huh. You didn't. You didn't come all week, Anna. No Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday. No, because I uh, estaba enferma. Okay, Anna. No problem. It's okay, Anna. The, uh, you can watch the videos in YouTube, but we are uh, also working the platform. In this moment, is only the homework from yesterday. Mm -hmm. Yesterday, 
we are we learn how to explain process the instructions and today uh -huh. we, we practice but don't okay. worry Anna. don't worry i'm sorry no 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 Anna. you are sick you are sick you are sick no problem yeah. only listen to jaime explain and then we you participate in the other activities okay okay thank you teacher thank you Anna. thank you thank okay you. jaime teacher uh, in the, the process, uh, John Linares say that what is the process? How do you use the microwave in my group? John Linares uh -huh. and Jaime Reyes. And, and Maria, is right? It, and Maria explained how to use the microwave too. Uh -huh. John Linares is, is ta también. <laughs> it's too. Okay, okay. Yes. Uh, the, uh, he says, first, first must uh, make that he's connect. Uh, after that, press the button for open the door. Then put the food in the microwave. After that, close the door and then program, program uh, programming the 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 time and the how how many minutes prefer for for had the food. Um, and finally, uh, take the food and 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 eat and eating. <laughs> okay. It's, it's similar. It's similar. <laughs> it's similar. No, no, no. The important is your fluency. The important is your pronunciation, your fluency, and your vocabulary. Not the other. You practice yours. Jaime, only one mistake, and then no programming. Programming not is not correct. Then you program. Then you program, program. the time. Program okay. the time. Okay. Thank you, teacher. I, thank you. Good job. Good job, Jaime. Reyes, the king. Now is the la is the moment for the king. <laughs> yes, teacher. Uh huh. Uh, so, today the queen died. Ya murió la reina. It's time for the king. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> The kings. <laughs> yes, yes. Right. I well, I I I tell you five step instruction on the blender. First, first step uh, I assemble the blender, placing the glass on the base. Uh, then we must connect the cover to a power supply network in order to be energy safe. Uh, next, we must now place the fruit in the bowl. After that, uh, now we will place water and sugar to test. And finally, mix by placing the bottom of unserved. Only that. Excellent, Jaime. Thank you very much for the process. Two words that we need to practice. Repeat, cable. Jaime? Hey. Cable. Cable. Uh-huh, cable, correct. Uh-huh, and button, button. Button. Correct. Then you press the button. Button. Okay, teacher, thank you. Excellent, excellent job. Hey, congratulations for everyone to do the homework. Excellent, excellent class. In this moment, we are going to make the groups and we are going to practice the future. The future, we are going to have two activities in the future. Number one, your plans for Saturday and Sunday. And number two, the routines. So for example, okay, I asked my partner Jaime, Jaime, what are you going to do Saturday and Sunday? Oh, I am going to go to church on Sunday and I am going to go to uh, La Libertad to go visit Sunset Park. I usually stay home and watch TV, but this week I am going to, uh, in this moment is to, the plan for Saturday and Sunday and the routines is two different grammar. One grammar, 
going to, going to, or will. The other grammar, present tense. This is the routines. It's okay? Okay. Yes? Okay, let's take a look. Okay. Uh, Jose Arturo, how do you say iglesia? How do you say iglesia? Church. Okay, good. Uh -huh. How do you say... Uh, Hacer compras del super. How do you say that? Hacer compras del super. To go into the, the Rodolfo, market. Rodolfo? Going to the shopping. So, market. shopping puede ser el shopping center. Buy groceries. Excellent, Ana. There you go. Buy grocery. Exactly. In the chat, grocery. What is grocery? Grocery is shopping. The food, shopping for food. This is the grocery. Excellent. So now practice with your partner, the routines and the plan for this weekend. No, any questions for vocabulary? No? No. Okay.
All right. Okay, so what are your plans for it? Um, in my case, for this weekend, I go into the Sonsonate City um, for on on Saturday and Sunday. I go into the church, and after that, I I usually uh, to eat the dinner in the beach. Oh, okay. Do you usually eat dinner? Dinner or or, or my lunch. Depending okay. on the weather. Okay. All right. Who else? Me, teacher. Tell me. Okay. In my case, my plan in the Sunday is the next. I go with my ways and um, my children to watch the football in the morning. And then we go have lunches at the restaurant. Um, we also to go to the park in the afternoon or enjoy together with family. Good, very good go. Remember only also only one we also we go to the park okay we go sure. to the restaurant only one two mm -hmm. okay. thank you teacher. thank you thank you no good okay one more one more who else the plans me Arturo? me yeah. okay um my weekend plans are um i'm going to visit to my parents i'm going to visit my parents and I going to take out uh, to to dinner. Um, my routines um, and I usually get up at the seven a.m. and go to the bed at twelve p.m. on on Saturday. Okay, very good. Thank you, sir. No da, no go to the bed go to bed go to the restaurant yes but in the things in the house no that okay okay excellent all right thank you guys so much for connecting on monday we are going to continue uh, with unit two and finish unit two on monday and tuesday we begin unit three so remember work unit one and unit two because next week we have unit three next week is a little different Next week, class, Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday. Thursday, no, but Friday, yes. Okay? Okay, teacher. Hey, teacher. Okay, hey, teacher. Have a good night. Okay, thank you. Okay, have a good, good night, night everybody. Thank you. Good night. And a good weekend, good yes. Good and a good weekend, too. Good weekend. Uh -huh. Bye-bye. Bye-bye. Bye-bye.